Oh, what is up, everybody, and welcome back to Project Castaway. We are now into episode two. Uh, maybe. Uh, doesn't look like the game is wanting to. There we go. All right. Back to Project Castaway episode two. Uh, we are going to try and uh, slow down the movement a little bit. Uh, I appreciate the feedback. Uh, the game is very smooth and runs very well. Probably better than a lot of other games. It's definitely coming of age when it comes to the, the movement. Uh, but we don't need that high a sensitivity as we are not playing like a first person shooter PvP game. So we're going to try to slow it down in multiple ways. So there we go. We've we've slowed it down uh, in a way. So I am very fast in movement too. So this will also help me uh, not be. <laughs> so, all right. Oh, man. That was a good night's sleep. We got to get today going. All right. Got to find my uncle. Uh, out of character, by the way, they did... Uh, implement 0 0.43 I believe the day after I uh, played the game uh, the day before I uploaded it so uh, there is that we're gonna go ahead and change the audio to is very loud right, look at that we already have it down a lot but anyways so today we need to uh, we need to look into we need to go across the uh, the water and explore some of these islands. Maybe he's on one of them. <gasps> Wait, is that... Is that something in the water? We should go out there. We should save our game. I think the game's broken on uh, journal entries here. <laughs> All right. So what do we need to do to make a raft? Oh, you can make it one out of barrels or one out of tires. Got some barrels right here. What else do we need? I need three logs. Get those logs. Oh wait, here we go. I cut these down earlier. We can use these. Save this for later. Now what? Gotta find a way to steer it. And uh, here we go, a way to sail on it. some sticks and some cloth some large sticks probably can get those from over here oh, we only got two left we better make some more how's our axe doing 82 percent all right we'd probably be fine for now 
So anyways, hope everybody's doing well. Hope you guys enjoyed episode one. If you have not seen episode one, uh, it is out on the channel. Uh, the playlist will be linked uh, as the card up in the video. Otherwise, you can go back and watch that one. Uh, just basically landed on the, the island and, you know, got started. We got our, our little hut. We got our bed. We got our wheel. Got some good stuff, so. We also got uh, Permafrost that we played. We uh, uplo probably uploaded a video of that before this. But uh, make sure you check that out on the channel. We played that, I believe, last night on stream. Uh, pretty cool game. Pretty up pretty cool upcoming survival game. Uh, it's based in the snow, so uh, you gotta watch out for Frostbite. All right, so that's that. I better make this a little bit faster. Wonder what else I'll need. All right, just need six more of these. Shouldn't be long now. We also gotta find, uh, or we also gotta build more. Yeah, I went back and watched it. I mean, I'm used to it, I guess, but if you're not used to playing games or especially VR, uh, the movement can be daunting, I, I agree. These games are getting better, higher graphics, better movement, so it's like real, more than real time. It's it's very cool how technology has allowed gaming to be so good. Alright, we got four, five, six, seven. That's perfect. Might even be enough for the next uh, set of stuff, too. Probably not. <laughs> We need more cloth, I think, than anything, though. Yeah, three, I believe three was the, the golden number when it came to the raft. The amount of these, it's so quick. And when, when they updated the stability, oh, it made it even better. Oh, okay, I was about to say I'd be mad if you couldn't do it. All right, so we do need, uh, looks like well, quite a bit of sticks. Uh, we need three more cloth. Cloth is a little harder to get because we've already scavenged the beach a lot. Scavenged, is that the word? Uh, so they did upload uh, a new update for finding stuff. Now, obviously, this whole open journal with B and build a palm bed is kind of getting annoying, so we need we need to get that out of the way. So we're going to do that real quick. All right, so I also forgot that we do need to drink. I seen that in the top corner there. Our uh, water is getting really low. So this should, yeah, that should finish that quest. We just wanted to get that quest out of the way because it was just kind of like there. And I believe we need to get on to the next quest. Just in case it wants me to do that too. I guess we'll just leave it there. But yeah, we need to drink, so we're gonna go ahead and just utilize these coconuts. That way we can make a little bit of room. Oh, our raw meat is actually still good. That I did not know. That's cool. Man, I don't know. I can't remember how far back it was that we, uh, Took out the. Oh, is it a turtle, right? I don't believe we uh, did anything with the Komodo dragon or the, the weird looking lizard thing. He's got to know what a Komodo dragon is, right? Alright, we got our steaks. Um, we will eat one and see how long it takes for that to, oh god. That is a wolf spider, we definitely don't want to interact with that. 
Okay. So we are doing water. And we are clearing out that quest to see if we can find if there is any more. So uh, the update, yeah, it states that they have like locators now for things. So like when there's a note or a bottle, it'll indicate where it is so we don't have to play a guessing game or search forever to find it. Uh, those are flags. Huh. Oh my god. There's flags here. Where'd those come from? Bug repellent? Oh, well, that's gonna come in handy. Just killed a wolf spider. Hopefully there's nothing else any more dangerous. Got some tires. Alright, that should be enough cloth now. We need to venture out and find our uncle. Time is very important. He could still be alive. Yeah, it says there's indicators, but uh, I haven't seen anything. Still don't know what lemongrass is for. We'll worry about uh, getting better stuff later. We're not going to venture into the water yet, so. I know there's supposed to be more bottles and sticky notes on this island, but as of right now, I haven't seen any. I think we found that one or two, maybe. Alright, that's enough cloth. Now we just need to get a couple more wood sticks and we'll be good to go. And again, guys, we do go live every night, 9 p.m. to 10 p.m. is when we start and we finish at like 2, 3, 4, 5 a.m. So... Just depending on, uh, you know, what we're playing or who's on or, you know, stuff like that. It is October, so we're probably going to be playing some scary games solo, maybe with people. Um, okay, we can steer the raft now. Wow, that's new. Oh, okay. I am okay with this. Where should we go now? Let's check out the debris real quick. Hopefully that's not a body out there. Uh, this doesn't feel fast anymore. Wait, is that a... <gasps> That's a submarine. I'm going to re I'm have to remember to come back. Can't do anything with it right now. Oh god, I hope we can get out of this. Doesn't look like it. Oh wait, there we go. I guess it stays in one place now. It used to move. Well, maybe back once we can get out of this. <clears throat> All right, classic me getting stuck in the probably the one spot that still got a little bit of a bug. <laughs> All right, we got out though. So that's the submarine. 
And now we're headed on to a new island. Got a little bit of food on us as long. Oh, 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 what? All right, we gotta fix that too, guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of upset that this isn't fast anymore. I mean, I would understand if there's like a wind direction and it would be faster if we're going in the direction of the wind, but that doesn't seem possible either. Well, we'll come back soon. All of our stuff's there for now. There's a boat here, though. That looks like a, a local boat. What is that? It's pretty overgrown here. Anybody in here? <gasps> An ancient vase. I wonder what I can do with this. If I ever get off the island, I can maybe sell it. I don't know. Oh, I like this area, though. It's really pretty. Just a really bad time to be stuck. It's berries. What is that? A blueprint. Oh. No, no, no. Spiders everywhere. It's another island over there. It's more yucca. Oh, what is this? Another one? A mulch sack. Wow. This might be useful later. Oh, that's not cool. I thought there was something floating in the water. But I guess technically there is. It's a shark. Be able to build up a raft with these. Maybe we can put more stuff on it and go a little bit further. A little bit faster, maybe. I don't know why I said further. It's weird. got the stuff that we need now. We can upgrade our raft a little bit. Better get some food and water. There we go. Still got to get the other side too, but I'm sure we'll be able to do that later. Let's explore over here. What is this? There's something under the ground? But I can't dig, can I?
you collect them now? That I did not know. That's cool, though. I guess it's nothing. Another barrel. If I could find one more, we could upgrade our raft just a little bit more. There's one more. All right. Take this back. that last barrel. Maybe there's something else over here, though. <gasps> Another blueprint. <gasps> I can make a cleaver? There is a spade. Maybe we should try that. Chili pepper. It's like that's all that's on this island. Well, I guess if we need chili papers later on, we'll have to come back here. But for now, I'm gonna go see what that is over there. It's like trees are growing in the water. I wonder how and why. I think my raft got slower. Doesn't look like anything. Just a tree in the water. So weird. Let's go to the next island. Looks like there's one over here. It's got a weird shaped rock on it. Maybe, maybe people thought there would be people over there so they would head that way I'll do the same all right we're almost there such a weird looking rock I wonder if there's anything here there's something right here what is that Another note? William's letter. I'm William Hargrove, a sailor aboard the merchant vessel Neptune's Bounty. A 
A sudden violent storm drove us, drove us off course and onto the treacherous rocks of this deserted island. The ship is wrecked beyond repair, and many of my comrades were lost at sea. Those of us who survived are now marooned with dwindling supplies and no means of communication. We've tried signaling for help, but our efforts have been in vain. It's as if the world has forgotten us. Food is scarce, and fresh water is becoming harder to find. The island feels cursed. Strange sounds echo through the night, and our fires often go out without explanation. I've seen remnants of previous castaways, old campsites, tattered clothing, and bones bleached by the sun. It's clear we, have, we are not the first to suffer this fate. If you find this letter, please alert the authorities and send rescue. Our hope fades. Our hopes fade with each passing day, but perhaps this message can bring us salvation. William Harsko. Oh, man. Somebody else? Got another pirate flag. Must be the bones he was talking about. Lots of pirate flags. Wonder if I can build a storage container. Be the one that looks like a chest. <laughs> Guess we can't build on the raft. That makes no sense. Ah, oh, here we go. Well, this isn't as big as I want the raft to be. I wonder if we should wait. I'm just going to leave these here. I'll probably come back. Right now, we don't have room for anything else. Well, there goes that. Guess they haven't fixed that bug yet. I wonder if that's him. Another barrel. <gasps> what is this? Another note. I'm sure everybody watching this is dreading me reading this one. I can't read. <laughs> so hard to see these. And my voice is like all messed up right now too, so I apologize, guys. William's letter two. This is William Harsgro Harvgrove. Still stranded on this godforsaken island, it's been weeks, maybe months since I last wrote. And our situation has only grown more dire. Our food supplies have dwindled to almost nothing and the fresh water sources are drying up. The island's eerie curse seems to tighten its grip on us daily. The strange sounds at night have become more frequent. And now, some of us claim to hear whispers. Our fires continue to be extinguished without reason. Plunging us into darkness, the sense of being watched is overwhelming. 
and it's driving us on the edge of madness. We've made up several attempts to build a raft and escape, but the sea is relentless. Each time, our makeshift vessels are destroyed by the violent waves. Hope is fading fast, and morale is an at-all-time low. It's a, good, uh, it's a good music group. We argue more than ever, and some of the men have simply wandered into the jungle, never to return. I'm guessing they weren't on this island. I mean, it is a bottled note, so it's most likely it came from a different island. <laughs> um, never to return. I found more evidence, but of those who came before us, bones scattered among the trees, rusted tools and scraps of clothing. It's a stark reminder that the escape is a distant dream. Still, I hold on to a, silver, a sliver of hope that this letter might reach someone. If you find this, know that we are desperate. We need help. Please alert the authorities and send a rescue party. We cannot hold on much longer. And I feel that what will become of us is this torment. As this, I fear what will become of us if this torment continues. With fading hope, William Hargrove. Wow. Okay, so he's uh, he's probably dead. Oh, that's so sad. I wonder if he met my uncle. Another tire. Please tell me there's not one of each. Yeah, they should definitely make sure there's at least two <laughs> on every island. Oh no. It's getting late. Or I'm just getting tired. I'm just getting tired, I guess. Another barrel. Just need one more tire. We can expand the raft just a little bit more. Wonder what else is here. It's another box. Wonder if there's something else in it. Another pirate flag? I don't want to be a pirate though. I just want to get out of here. Should I climb up there? I think somebody might have went up there to see if they could see anything further in the distance. I guess it's possible. Let's go check up there. And then we gotta finish the raft and get out of here. I'll probably have to sleep. I'm getting tired. My sanity is also dwindling. Our cooked meat is still good. Thank you, developers. <laughs> I wasn't so tired. Oh, what is that? Is that a mushroom? I wasn't so tired. This would be easier. Oh, I can walk through those now. Thank goodness. Before, it was like they were invisible. And I couldn't do anything except for get stuck on them. see what we can see where'd we come from I think that's our first island there's so many out there guess we know which way to go now all right I better get down carefully and we're gonna go to sleep and we'll venture out tomorrow check out the other couple of islands that we've seen. Ow. That sounded a lot worse than it was. Got our two barrels and one tire. Did we forget the other tire? We did. Build that up tomorrow. Hopefully we can find this William Harsgrove. Hopefully he's still alive. I wish he would have left a date. Not that I know which day it is. It's only been a day since I've been on the island. This is the second day.
Can we not make it any bigger? We'll just put these on first and see. I think we can turn this around. Here we go. Push it back to shore. Let's see if we add some more wood to this, if it'll work. We need one more. Got enough for the raft. We put a bed down. We're gonna go to sleep after this. That way we're good enough to head on out. This should fix it. So I hope so. I guess we'll just extend it this way. We can place another one of these here. There we go. Just like new. Let's go ahead and go to sleep. We'll finish the raft tomorrow. guys that is going to be it for this episode episode two if you guys enjoyed that let me know uh we went out and ventured out a little bit we got a uh, a raft going it's nighttime so it's gonna be a little tricky um we might have to take some precautions seems like they say there's a lot of issues with the nighttime but uh we haven't really seen anything just yet uh, we've also slept throughout the night so there is that. Uh, inventory space would be nice to be able to put like a just a regular basic chest. Or even to put that note holder. Oh, we need one more log. But uh, it's fine if we don't, you know. We need to carry the string and some flint and stuff like that. Or whatever, not flint, but you know what I mean. Sticks. And then the stone shards, I believe. That way we can always make an axe. Well, let's go ahead and eat. It is raining now, so that's good. Looks like our food's staying pretty good, too. I'll grab this uh, coconut here. And one more of these, and we're good to go. So we're going to go ahead and save it and get off. And thank you guys again so much. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying the series so far. Uh, we'll probably try to take this with us. As that is an artifact. Uh, we have four now. Five? 
We have five now. Hopefully this will be a little bit faster. Maybe they just made it a little bit more logical because it was extremely fast. But it was nice to not have to worry about it. <laughs> like we could get to the next place like immediately. So that was awesome. But yeah, if you guys want to see more of this, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and uh, I will see you guys in the next episode. Episode 3 will be out in a few days. So if you guys want me to do these, like, legit series closer, I can always do that. Uh, I've just been spreading them out just because they've been demos and stuff, or trials, or alphas, or betas. But if we're doing, like, an official playthrough, I could always group them together so you guys could see them better and faster so and not lose interest hopefully but yeah thank you guys again so much keep on smiling keep on gaming i'll see you in the next one don't forget to check out chatham is gaming over on twitch go live every night between 9 and 10 p.m and till like 2 or 3 4 a.m central standard time so if you guys want to see me play some crazy pvp games most likely uh obviously it's october so we'll be playing some spooky games so i'll see you guys then so okay love you bye